What's up my peoples? Listen, today I've got two major things on the calendar. One of them is to continue to work on the rebranding for the channel. Uh, you guys know I switched over from Grace for Life with Jason Mayfield to Jason Mayfield and I kind of just threw some stuff out there. But with this new room, this new aesthetic, we probably need some new graphics that kind of meld with that. And then the second thing is, is that I got my paper roll in, so I'm gonna have to get a paper roll up on the wall. Only got one in. I got two more coming, but I only need one to get it up there. But first, Grace for Life 2019 Bible journaling time. Allie, what are you doing? Why are you throwing it away? Because it is a spoon. Mm. Mom forgot to bring um, us ice cream. You forgot the ice cream? Yeah, I know. Are you are not complaining to Dad, man, because I got you good medicine. Don't you, don't you come out here and use your alligator eyeballs <laughs> with Dad, man. Did I get you something else to make up for it? I still make my soup, but I only ice cream. Cookie dough, did it make you feel better? Yeah. Oh, I'm so sorry. I need to go get your big stuff. Go away, you sick child. So this is the other critical component of the day is the graphic design. So I'm kind of caught between the two. Got to put this paper up, but I got to do the graphic design. And uh, Trish is trying to figure out, you know, what that look's going to be. The look is really important. When you lock that down, it makes all the work that you have after that really simple because it answers a lot of questions. What's a Bible graphic going to look like? What's a lower third going to look like? What's it going to look like if I do an intro? What's it going to look like if I do notes? So once you lock down that style, everything is easy to execute because those questions have been answered and you're not having to come up with some creative solution every time you come to a thumbnail or a web page or whatever that may be so just gotta gotta kill it right now i'm wrangling tools that i've placed all over the place made a little mistake. Thought I had more margin than I did, but. Whenever you uh, get a second, I'm pretty sure your youngest daughter just uh, water exploded out of the toilet a little bit. Uh, she pooped. I don't know what happened, but she's crying. She's scared. And just like that, we have a totally different background. It's a different color now. All right, so in like a crazy ending to this video, I don't really have the studio set up. This is not like a background that I'm planning on using, even though it looks kind of awesome, even with that orange bucket sitting right there. But um, I uh, just wanted to stop for a minute and tell you that I got all those graphics done. I am officially going to transition over to those now at the end of this video. So I'm going to sit here, stare in the screen, and those graphics will roll on the screen so you can see them for the first time.
I also just needed to do a quick test and see if the audio was buzzing based on the new setup that I have going that's pretty monstrosorous. Monstrosorous? Monstrous? One of those. Anyway, hey, listen, I'll see you guys later. Bye!